Hi, my name is Elizabeth Doherty Thomas, and I'm co-founder of the Doherty Relationship Institute. In pulling out from my father, Bill Doherty, who's been doing couples therapy since the 1970s, a lot of um, how I've used couples therapy in creating the training, we stumbled across um, not the concept of agency, but we we confirmed that there's actually so much research. You can go to Google Scholar and look up agency. Agency is the sense of control. I have the ability to make choices, the ability to sort of act according to how I want to act. That is so foundational. It's cross-cultural. It's, it's everywhere. So what I want to talk about in this video is actually the agency we have as clinicians, as couples therapists. If one or both partners early, it's usually early on, first couple sessions is just not buying what we offer, right? They're yeah, butting us, they're um, challenging us, they're saying, I don't think this is right. Um, or they're not doing that. They're just looking at the window. They're talking about being busy and they maybe not schedule again. They're just, there's just not a lot of energy. Um, in our view, that's okay. They have agency. They have the right to say this isn't working. They have a right to not continue to see us. So that's their agency. We also have a right to gracefully name what's going on and what we see. And the reason that's so important to my father is to avoid half-hearted couples therapy. So stepping back, couples therapy has become a very normative thing to do. So a lot of couples kind of decide, oh, we have to go to couples therapy. In our view, in, in my father and I's view, that doesn't mean that they're actually that interested in couples therapy or ready for it. Life could be busy. Life could be chaotic. They maybe thought it was a pill and it's like, oh, it's a lot of work. So we believe strongly that that is just fine if people are not ready, really, really ready to do the work. We don't have to doom their marriage. And we also think it's fine if they're not jiving with how we do couples therapy. So there's a traction protocol inside the Doherty approach, which is the, the membership you can join anytime as a couples therapist. And it is such a liberating way to gently call basically the lack of energy and buy-in into the therapy. I think that's worth, worth the price of admission myself. It's very liberating to realize I have agency. I don't need to keep cheerleading somebody. I don't need to get so annoyed at somebody that I end up perping on them in the room. I don't need to be a victim if as a clinician, they're not really bringing in energy to the room. There's a way to gracefully call it and end it. And if you're interested in how um, Bill Doherty does that, check us out at thedohertyapproach.com.